Hey everybody, welcome back to another video, and in today's video of HipG talking to a microphone, we're going to be predicting season 14. That means I'm putting prizes in the levels, in like just predicting the prizes. Should be pretty straightforward. So my prediction, level 2 will be the volleyball rims. These are some pretty cool rims, and they're really interesting, and they're really unique, and I, I kind of like them. Honestly, I don't really have a lot to say about these, but... If these do get added, they're going to be like a knockoff soccer rims. It's pretty cool to see this. And for the level 3 season pass exclusive, 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 the torpedo spoiler. This is literally the spoiler from the torpedo just taken off of it. Make any car the torpedo with this spoiler. This submission has over 300 upvotes, so hopefully we'll be getting this. For level 4, the mini golf set. This is a really cute idea, and I think it fits great with the theme. It's a very long furniture item too, so it's going to be interesting to see it. Okay, my prediction for the level 5 season pass exclusive is the Martini V2 skin. Now, this is a really cool skin, and I actually know this guy. His name is Dr. Radium, and he's gotten a few items into the game, such as the Rubik's Cube couch, the track toy rims, the grand piano, and the wall safe. Overall, this is a really nice skin. I really like it. It's very clean. And I don't have much to say about it except for I like it. Okay, so for my prediction for level 6 is the metal rims. Not the metal rims, the metal rims. These are pretty cool and they look even better with the gold color or sand if you don't have the gold color. My prediction for level 7, the season pass exclusive, the used baseball texture. It's an interesting texture and also a pretty nice one. I like this one honestly. It's very clean, even though the whole point is for it to be dirty, but clean in a different way than that. Now, for level 8, I think this season we are getting a car just like in season 11. It's a car that definitely cannot be the level 10 prize, but would be amazing as a level 8 car. Clogging in at over 500 upvotes and being the 5th most upvoted entry of this season, it's the golf cart. This actually looks amazing. I wish that if you took a sharp turn that you would fall out. That would be hilarious. Anyways, this is most definitely going to be the level 8 prize. My prediction for the level 9 season pass exclusive is the pitching machine. This spoiler is a really cool one and I honestly really like it. I really like animated spoilers, so hopefully I'm right about this one. Alright, now for my prediction for the level 10 prize. Now, this is probably not a prediction, like, it is a prediction. But it's probably going to be the right prediction. So, unfortunately, my favorite cars of this season are most likely not going to be added. And those two were the Hekka Absolute and the Diva. Now, excuse my like um, pronunciation of the Hekka Absolute. I'm going to have to look up how to pronounce that later. But I'm going to put some pictures on screen. That's what I wanted to win. There's the Hekka and then there's the Diva, the Acura NSX. Now these are really cool, and I'm super disappointed that these cars didn't win. But nobody cares about my opinion. You want to all know what won, or what's probably going to win. The car that will get level 10 is the Limitless 900, the Porsche 919 Evo by Oof Ed. There you go, there's the picture. It just looks amazing. Now, I'm not saying that this is a, a bad car, I'm just, I wanted my other favorite cars to win, but I'm still happy that this is probably going to win. It's super cool and super clean, and there's the ever-present Shrinch, the trademark of Ufed. So, honestly, I really like this car, I think it's beautiful, but it's like, too beautiful. This car shouldn't be so easy to get, this thing should be rare. I wish that the seasons were as hard as season 1, where you had to buy the season pass and grind every single day to get level 10. Imagine every 9 year old playing jailbreak who barely grinds the seasons and posts on reddit, will I get to level 10? Like just imagine all of those kids, they have this beautiful car, but like nobody's gonna use it because A, it has, it's gonna have mediocre speed because they can't have an overpowered season prize like they did with the beignet. And B, everybody's going to own it. Seasons need to be harder. I'm going to say that again. They need to be harder. I'm not saying that they need to be extremely hard, but still hard as like season one. You know how hard that was. I feel like if you don't buy the season pass and you don't grind every day, you really shouldn't be getting this car because I almost feel like 
getting these awesome cars, you need some level of dedication that people who would just casually log in every couple days and grind their contracts without even the season pass, and they just still get it. Anyway, enough ranting, let's predict the top 2% prize. Alright, so for our, my top 2% prediction is the baller rims. Not this baller, but these. It's a basketball on a rim. Looks pretty cool. Well, that's it for me predicting the season. I hope you enjoyed. Hopefully I get most of these right, and hopefully in the future they will make seasons harder. Actually, let me ask a Simo real quick. Baller!